Fishing offers me peace. It's almost like therapy. Fishing is almost part of my fabric of my being. I mean, I've been fishing since I was old enough to remember. It kept me grounded, kept me out of a lot of different troubles and a lot of different things that were going on in my neighborhood. You think you have a resource that runs through the city that it's beautiful and that it's taken care of, but there's things that's underneath the water and underneath the surface that can hurt you. This stretch of river historically has been really industrialized. So, so there's been a lot of history of industry and past practices were not the cleanest. This advisory applies to resident fish only. Resident fish are those that don't migrate. So those that live in the Willamette River all the time. And those are fish like bass, carp, and catfish are the ones that have the highest contaminant levels. The people we're most worried about are young kids, like babies and, and nursing infants in particular, because PCBs can cause developmental problems with young kids. It can cause impaired brain development so that there could be drops in IQ later in that person's life. If you come to the river, make sure you know what's going on and the risks that are gonna be at the spot that you're at and that way you're able to enjoy more.